All right, we'll go ahead and get started with Garrett Hansen. Thomas, go ahead. Uh, yes, Garrett, um, today, a couple hard hit balls the opposite way. Looks like it's some of the things you're working on. Buddy talked about that also. Um, how proud are you that uh, some of the stuff that you've been working on when maybe the playing time hasn't been as regular, you're able to put into practice during the game? Yeah, it's nice to see uh, some of the stuff you're working on, you know, behind the scenes, kind of show up in the game, which is always good. I've always used to use the field pretty well and um, just trying to get back to to that, being able to, there's a lot of hits in the opposite field. So, uh, you know, I think it's a big point. Yeah, we talked a little bit in Milwaukee before one of the games and I brought up the right left splits and you really were having none of it. It's like you can't just concentrate on one on one side versus the other. Uh, this series against the Pirates, though, you were able to prove the numbers quite a bit in that. Uh, what does it mean to you to get the playing time and to carry it into a game to where you don't have to necessarily worry about that label right hand versus left hand? Yeah, I mean, I don't I don't really worry about it if there's any label, but um, it's nice to get hits no matter who's throwing, throwing the ball at me. So, um, you know, it doesn't really bother me. And as far as this team is concerned, um, to, to come back home after kind of a couple of disappointments in Milwaukee, get a sweep of the Pirates and generally play good baseball throughout it. What does it say about the team? What does it mean for you guys going forward? Yeah, we played, uh, you know, really clean baseball Our pitchers. You know, they, they threw the ball extremely well this whole series. Um, just not many hits out there for them. And uh, credit to them. And they executed their pitches. And, and uh, you know, it's easy as an offense when the pitchers are throwing up zeros. And uh, we can kind of, you know, scratch and claw here and there. We ended up scoring, you know, a lot of runs the last two games. Uh, but just pitchers are throwing up zeros. It's, 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 uh, that's, that's the recipe to to win a, win a game. So as an offense, uh, that's that's huge for us. Um, last one for me. Buddy was talking about how every player in there is kind of working on something, trying to get better. What is the atmosphere like in there when you know the guy next to you maybe isn't satisfied with exactly where he is in your career? You're not satisfied with where you are. You want more. Does it feel like a healthy atmosphere of guys all trying to grab more? Yeah, I think we got a lot of guys who are trying to establish themselves, you know, we, we've got some established veterans, obviously, um, you know, and then the rest of us are, you know, everybody wants to, to play and, and play like they know they're capable of every single day, be a starter, um, you know, so it's, it's awesome to see people working on different things and having success in the games. And, uh, we all root for each other. That's the biggest thing. And I think, uh, you know, it's off the field relationships and, and friendships and it carries on to the field. Thanks, Garrett. Danielle. Hi, Garrett. Kind of an out there question for you, but were you there when Yancy wrapped all the bats up and put hot sauce next to it and tried to create a little potion there? <laughs> um, yeah, I had to throw my bat in there too. So I, I didn't want to miss, I didn't want to miss any of that. So uh, that, was, that was good. Sometimes you got to do some weird stuff uh, to mix it up, get the offense rolling a little bit. And, uh, you know, it seemed to work out. Like, did you know what he was doing or did he just say, come get your bat? I need to put it in this potion. No, I mean, I had no idea. All I, I saw people grabbing bats um, and doing something weird. So I, I had to join in for sure. I'm not going to miss out on any, any hits. And you think the good juju worked for you guys this week? I mean, the hits came alive after you did that. Absolutely. I mean, I think us baseball players, we're always going to look for something out there. Uh, Give us, give us some good luck or some good juju. And, um, you know, I think it was that. Thank you. Kyle Fredrickson. Hey, Garrett. Uh, we saw just sort of through the game notes today that it's Bud Black's birthday. Just curious if, if that was recognized as a group today. And and I also was just wondering, you know, your time, uh, you know, in the majors and with this club, just what, what have you really grown to appreciate most about his leadership style? Yeah, we definitely, we knew it was his birthday. Um, everybody was, was saying happy birthday this morning. Hopefully there's a cake back there that I got to get in, but, uh, uh, he's just, he, he keeps it, he keeps everybody loose. And, um, uh, you know, that's, that's what we respect about him. No matter how, uh, you know, up the, for the ups and downs, you know, he's the same guy. So, um, that allows us to be, you know, follow suit and be the same guy and showing up 
you know, every day to, to win, win the ball game. Nope, Larry Patrick. Yes, uh, Garrett, with your, you know, speed and your, your gap hitting and, and one thing or another, what kind of player do you feel you, you can be? Do you look at yourself as a possible 300 hitter? Yeah, I do. Uh, I think, uh, you know, being able to affect the game in, in a number of different ways with my, with my speed, you know, defense and, and, and hitting. Uh, so, you know, I don't really, really throw out any goal, any, uh, you know, numbers or anything, but, um, you know, I got, I know I got a lot more intent. Halfway through the season here now, the season's halfway over, you know, the Rockies are 15 games out of third. There are 10 games uh, up on uh, the Diamondbacks in fifth place. Have the goals of the team changed at all as far as, hey, let's go out and have a winning record, or are you still thinking that, uh, Um, no, we don't, we're not, a. Uh, there's no new goal or anything. Um, we want to win every single game. So, you know, we show up with the intention of, of winning that game. You know, we, I know we all know we got to clean it up on the road a little bit, um, and play better. We're, we're definitely capable of doing that. Um, you know, when, when, when we're good, you know, we're rolling. Uh, I think we, we've fallen into too many you know, pretty tough losing streaks, you know, that, that kills, a, kills a ball club. But as far as like, you know, setting a new goal or standard, that's not really what we're talking about. Uh, we're still just trying to show up every day and, and, and execute as an offense and same with the pitchers go and uh, just try to get a win that day.